this presentation i am going to describe the next week's trend as per the one standard deviation principle i will also take you across the last week's trend analysis what we have done and what we have achieved so last week's trend analysis was given to you on 10th march and if you are a regular visitor of our website you would have downloaded the report from our website from this following link so here is the link wherein if you just give a click it will download the respective weeks trend report so here we are using the principle one standard deviation and uh, this uh, real time volatility estimate so last week's report was given on the 10th of march and that was the 70 73rd week so we have given for this uh, trend report so what happened this is uh, on the uh, before that up election result and there was a gap up opening happened it was uh, in the range of 9090 above so there was a gap up opening so all the levels what we have calculated it has surpassed all, most most of the levels so this report most of you will not be in a position to use this particular report and following uh, means after getting that particular effect of that uh, gap up opening i have already sent you one more email on the 14th of march so in this i have given you the revised report of the nifty future using the one standard deviation principle so here i have given you the uptrend was 9133 and crossover of 9190 will target 9215 and so on and i have also given you how you can trade in case of a uptrend breakout gives in case of a downtrend breakout gives how you can trade so in fact what you will find out on 14th this one be being given so 15th you got a breakout 9130 level it has come and today so today was the 17th the last trading day so you have achieved till if i look into the day high so day high was 921 2.7 this is the nifty future so two level of targets is being achieved as per the revised level however the first level whatever it is given on the 10th of march we have not achieved any of the target because there was a huge gap of opening was there so this is the outcome of the last two weeks trend report or the trend analysis now coming to the coming weeks trend analysis which is being from 20th to 24th march this is valid so this is the 74th week we are giving this particular report and the real time estimate of volatility says that 7.58% and the last traded price 9168 so based on this i have estimated 96 point of price oscillation is expected and once this price gives a uptrend breakout above 9191 you'll be getting the first target as 9227 second as 9244 third as 9253 and so on and if the downtrend breakout gives at 9145 you can achieve the first target at 9108 and the last target at 9012 so same thing i have just explained here and i have also given you the detailed procedure how you can trade in the uptrend and how you can trade in the downtrend in case of a uptrend breakout 9191 above you must buy the future along with the put option 9200 always i used to advocate that you must trade with the option and once you achieve the first target 9227 trail your stop loss to the 0.382 level of our calculation which is 9205 once you achieve the second target 9244 trail your stop loss to 0.5 level of your calculation once we achieve the third target trail your stop loss to the 0.618 level of our calculation so this is how you should trade in the uptrend 
and similar procedure I have given how you can trade in the downtrend along with the option which you can hedge with that. And using the same principle also I have just calculated the trend level for Bank Nifty and that is for 20th to 24th March and uh, the uptrend is getting set at uh, 21,355 and downtrend is at 21,100. So this is how you should trade in the future and if you are an option hedger you have lot many opportunity to trade as per this report. If you are going to trade the option strategies then you can think of buying 9000 uptrend crossover given you can think of buying the 9200 call option and sell 9300 50 call option, 325 is the last target, so 3, 350 call option and book your profit, book your profit once the nifty goes to the first or second target which is 92272-9243. So once the nifty gives a breakout above 9190, buy 9200 call option, you can think of selling the 9300 call option also. So and once the nifty attends the first or second target, you can think of booking the profit. Similar way you can form the downtrend option strategy. If the downtrend breakout 9145 is given, think of buying 9150 strike put option and sell 9050, 9050 put option, each one lot. So this is net debit Bear spread. So in case of a uptrend breakout, you can form net debit bull spread. In case of a downtrend breakout, you can form net debit bear spread. Many other strategies you can able to initiate in this. But one good suggestion I can give at this point of time. If you are using any intraday principle, any intraday principle including one standard deviation. This is a very low volatility scenario. So it is 7% of annual volatility is being calculated based on the real time estimate 7.5%. So this is a very low volatile market. So even, even though if you enter in the intraday trade better do not carry the trade beyond your second target of your estimation. So this kind of consolidation or this kind of low volatility scenario doesn't provide enough opportunity to do intraday trade in an optimized manner. However, if you have entered the trade or if you are going to enter the intraday trade, stick to the first or second target. Do not carry the target trades beyond that. And that will be the best procedure to trade in this particular type of market and whenever the volatility is to maintain below 10% in index, especially in the principal index. So here Nifty is a principal index. So when this kind of scenario persists, less than 10% volatility you are getting, that signals that we have entered to a deep consolidation zone. So maybe some kind of corrections we may expect in the coming days before the trend regimes in any direction or will consolidate for a period of time. So for that reason, so you need to be little restrictive for the coming week till the volatility is not improved. Once the volatility improves, you will get good opportunity to trade. So in case of a very high volatility band or in case of a very low volatility band, we have to little be cautious on the market. So, so that is how the mature traders can behave in the market. So this is how you can trade coming week. So 9191 above the uptrend sets, 9143 below the nifty future downtrend sets. If any trend breakout gives, if the uptrend breakout gives, then you have chances to achieve 9324 level. If the downtrend breakout gives, you have all chances to achieve 9012 level. So Intermediate levels as for the Fibonacci principle is been given here. Just download this report and go through the sections 
mentioned here how to trade in the uptrend and downtrend along with the option strike to hedge similar style of trading you can adopt in the back nifty also and if you own our software which comes at a cost of 2017 you can use the similar concept in the stock futures equities and in other trades so to know more about our product visit our website under the product segment you will get all the details so here the one standard deviation product which comes at a price of 2750 per year and we have many courses along with the software if you are intraday trader we have 34 intraday trading technique along with the software if you are option trader we have fantastic course available for the option course option trading so that also you can have a look on this course content from this link and based on your different trade requirements we have designed different different courses so to be a long term achiever in the market you need to educate yourself about the market internals because without having a proper information and proper knowledge in the market it is very difficult to make money in the market so if your long term objective is to be a professional trader to earn from the market in a professional manner so better spend some money and learn some stops which will really help you in making money and which will really help you to identify the trade and this one standard deviation is method is one of our 32 intraday trading technique method so in this particular method it is a well tested method so we are we have projected weekly trend follow it up and feel how true it is 